I am doing a video today of a beautiful little two-bedroom single-family house with a one-car garage located right here in downtown Clinton, New York, 13323. My name is Michael Stanton. My phone number is 315-853-1967. So, the address of this property is 173 Sanford Avenue in Clinton. Sanford is spelled S-A-N-F-O-R-D. So again, 173 Sanford Avenue in Clinton, New York. Well, we might as well start here in the kitchen. I redid this house completely around five years ago. And I really had an objective of taking this small space that was where the kitchen was originally in this house. And I completely redid it. And it took quite a bit of planning because I really wanted to take a small space and make it big. And I think I achieved that. First of all, I used a really cool red themed composite quartz silestone uh, countertop, which not only was expensive, but really just came out gorgeous. Down at uh, JK Lumber, they said that I was the only guy to ever use this countertop, and I'm so happy with it. It's just stunning. Along with the uh, solid hickory cabinetry with the stainless steel poles and the stainless steel uh, oven and fridge and a black, I'm sorry, <laughs> stainless steel microwave oven and a black fridge over here. I even put a cabinet up there. So you've got a lot of space here in a fairly small kitchen, but you really wouldn't know it's small because you've got so much storage space. So I'm really happy, actually, with all the properties I own, which is 55, I'm more happy with this kitchen than any of them. So let's go to the front of the house here. And while I'm here, let's look out the front door. Here's a look at the front. You got a beautiful little redwood colored front deck here. And again, this is Sanford Avenue. Filming this here in the fall, so the leaves are coming down. It's a beautiful neighborhood, absolutely beautiful. The house is red, if you can see that. The entire theme of this house was done in a scarlet red. So what I did is, not only is the countertop over there red, but the ceilings are red with black trim everywhere in the entire house. In the front of the house here you've got your bathroom, full-size tub, your sink, and your mirror, and your commode. Okay, so the bathroom's in the front of the house. Here's your living room. Thermal pane windows throughout with nice blinds. This is your front bedroom, the smaller bedroom. Again, you got the red ceiling. Hardwood floors. <clears throat> your uh, closet. And every room has cable TV. Okay. You've seen the kitchen. There it is again. So walking over this way, <clears throat> looking into there, I'm not going to go up there, but that is the attic. Okay, you got a full-size attic up there. Here's your rear bedroom. This bedroom is quite a bit larger, and again, it has cable TV in it that I just stepped on. Open closet, closed closet. And your view out the back is towards the back of the yard there, okay? There's your garage there to the right that you'll see. And if you can see there, I see it looks a little bl blurry, but your yard goes all the way to that fence back there. And right behind that is the, um, the, uh, <laughs> the uh, high school at the Clinton Mill, uh, Clinton Cider Mill. So we're going downstairs into the basement here. <clears throat> see if I can find some lights. So again, I did this house completely over in, I think, 2013, 2014, everything, new roof, Everything, okay? An entirely new electrical panel, uh, washer dryer hookup, hot water tank. There it is right there, July 2nd of 2013. That's when it was redone, okay? Everything in the house. However, the furnace is brand, brand new. There it's right there, December 22nd, 2016. The furnace that was in here was from uh, 1950. <laughs> it actually lasted like 70 years. And uh, it finally blew up, so we put a brand new furnace in it last uh, Christmas. And you've got the second part of the basement over here. And you've got a nice 
huge work table here, okay? The floor in the basement is all um, painted gray. Nice and dry basement. Okay, so let's take a look out the back here. We'll go out back, how's that? Here we are in the backyard. So, the yard goes from here all the way over to there, back to the fence, okay? And again, straight over that way is the uh, Clinton High School and for orientation purposes, the Clinton cider mill is right on the other side of that house. So you're about an eighth of a mile from downtown Clinton, literally less than a five minute walk. One car garage again, but it's actually quite large. You can get uh, a motorcycle and a snowmobile and a car in there, if you so desire. So my name again is Michael Stanton. My phone number is 315-853-1967. I own 55 houses and apartments all together between the towns of Clinton, Vernon, and Oneida. And I like doing videos and pictures. If you go to my website, michaelstantonproperties.com, I'll spell it. M-I-C-H-A-E-L-S-T-A-N-T-O-N, properties. michaelstantonproperties.com. I got a nice website, I might say. And this video will be on there along with probably 15 or 20 other photos showing availability date and price and uh, so forth. I do allow pets on a case-by-case -case basis. Do not call me if you have a Doberman or a Rottweiler or a Pitbull especially or a German Shepherd. I will not rent to you if you have one of those type of dogs. Okay, but I... Uh, I will definitely take and consider any pet you might have. Okay, so again, Michael Stanton, 315-853-1967. Through the years that I've had this house, everybody wants it. It's an awesome, awesome space. It really, really is. Thank you very much for taking the time to look at my video.